Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Nana M. My name is Lynn. If you're new, it's very, very nice to see you and I have had quite a few um, new subscribers recently, so thank you very much for popping over and thank you for subscribing. And if you are a returning viewer, welcome back my lovely friends. Today's video is one that I've been talking about for weeks <laughs> and it is one pair of jeans styled seven ways. So um, yeah, that's what today's, I've got glare on my glasses, I know I have. So that is today's video. So um, I've really enjoyed doing this video and there is another idea that I've got that seems to be going viral everywhere and it's called the 333 method. And it's where you take three tops, three bottoms and three pairs of shoes and make quite a few number of outfits out of them. So that's something I might be interested in doing if you are interested in watching. So you could let me know about that one. I'd be very, very grateful. So that being said, make yourself a cuppa, put your feet up, relax and watch me um, showing you how I styled my jeans seven ways. So see you at the end. Enjoy. So to start off with, I just wanted to prove the theory that you can't wear black and blue together is wrong because I think you can. So that's what I've decided to do for the first outfit. So I've just got on a very plain black long sleeve cotton t-shirt that you can get from absolutely anywhere. All the outfits I'll be wearing the gold jewellery, exactly the same. I've got jeans, obviously. I've got a black belt with a gold buckle to match the uh, jewellery. Jeans, obviously, and some little black boots. And I think that's absolutely fine. In fact, I think it's nice, I quite like it. So there's your black and your blue, but then I'm also going to just add a couple of extras to complete the outfit. So I'll show you those. So I've added a jacket. Well, it's a crombie, I think you call them. I don't know what you call these coats. It's very lightweight, it's only cotton. And it's got these kind of sleeves that you can roll back. Uh, it's got a lapel. I'll just go back and I've got a handbag, a little black handbag. And you can either use it like this or you can take the chain out and do it cross body or over the shoulder. So I'll show you the complete outfit. So as far as I'm concerned, black and blue, good to go. <laughs> I think this is an ideal outfit for going to the pub, going for a meal, Perfect. On to outfit number two. So this is outfit number two and I'm starting the other way around this time. I'm starting with the full thing on and then I'll take the coat off and the handbag. So I've got the black on again. I've got my black boots, black belt, black handbag, but I've just changed it up with this coat, three quarter length coat in like a sky blue, baby blue you will. So it's the same boots, same jeans and this sky blue coat. Same handbag, same jewellery like I said. <laughs> I'll take this off. This shirt was from Primark and what I've done is 
it, because it's got a shirt bottom I've tucked it in just on one side left the other side hanging down I've got my black belt on with the buckle showing there I've got the collar fastened all the way to the top but you could open it if you wanted to pulled my sleeves up and it's just bagging over at the back so that is just a different way to use a blouse. You can tuck it all in if you want to, obviously, like that. And it will still look nice. It's just that I wanted it to look a little bit different. So I just tucked off. Oh, you could tuck some of it in and just leave some of it hanging down. Just to just to just to give it that edge. <laughs> Same jewellery. So that is outfit number two. Go get changed. So we're on to outfit number three. This is a little bit more casual. It's just a plain white long sleeve t shirt. It could be short sleeved, it could be a vest, it doesn't matter. And I've tucked it in. I've got a, a gold belt on. I've turned my jeans over a couple of times at the, at the bottom to show a little bit of ankle because I've got flat shoes on. So it just makes me, because I'm so, for a, um, just so that it's noted, I am five foot one and I am a size 12. So because I'm petite in stature, um, if I wear flat shoes, I really need to show a little bit of ankle and it just elongates my leg and high rise jeans with a belt on um, also does the same thing. So I have been told. <laughs> so I've got pumps on. Turn round. So this is a casual look. This is a jacket that I got from a charity shop. I have shown it in a haul. I love it. It's a bit boho -y. But because I've got white trainers on and this white underneath, I'm letting my sleeves come down a bit and I've rolled those back just to show some white. And I've got a navy blue suede bag so i'm all navy blue and white in this outfit over the shoulder and that's this one so yeah casual casual but smart i think you could go out for lunch in this you could go shopping in it you could be on holiday touring if you were lucky enough to be swept away for the weekend <laughs> on a city break nice and comfy for walking around yeah so that my friends is outfit number three three go and find outfit number four <laughs> hope i don't run out i won't so this outfit's a little bit more of um oh what's happened <laughs> and maybe going to the pub maybe going out for a meal of an evening it's that kind of an outfit i think um so i've got um a deep kind of purpley leather well it's brown really it's like a very very deep brown bag a leather bag that i got made for me in um ibiza one year but it's the nearest I've got to purple because I've got some purple boots on. Anyway, I'll show you them in a minute. So I've got my camel coat on, jeans of course. I've got a bl little blouse on, gold belt and some little purple boots that I got from Next. I'll show you them in a minute. So that's the outfit. I think it's outfit number four, is it?
yeah I'll take the bag off show you what's underneath <laughs> take the coat off so it's just a blouse from next with a v-neck and it's got purple and it's got some gold in it can you see so that's the reason that i've paired it up with um a gold belt and it's got the purple went dizzy it's got the purple in it so that is the reason for the purple boots i'll take one off and show it you i don't want to fall over <laughs> oh dear So that's the boot. So you can see it picks up on that purple that's in that blouse and it goes well with the bag. So that's why I chose that bag. But I chose the gold belt because of the gold in the blouse and the gold jewellery, etc, etc. So yes, that is a nice outfit for going out for O'Neill an evening or just for a drink with your friends yeah one pair of jeans <laughs> we're going to get outfit number is it five forgot now I think so this time I've gone a bit casual again uh, but smart casual, I would say. So I've got the short um, sleeved t-shirt on and it's cream and like a camel colour. I've put tanned coloured belt on. Obviously the jeans. <laughs> I've turned them over, but I've only turned them over once and I've got some tanned shoes on to match the belt. Um, push puppies comfort <laughs> so that's the casual look without a jacket and I've got my suede suede biker jacket that I put on with this I think well, you could put lots of things on, couldn't you? Let's face it. So that's the biker jacket and the tanned coloured handbag that I got um, when I did the charity challenge, uh, shop challenge with uh, Maxine from Maxine Georgina. Do you remember that one? <laughs> well, that was the bag. So it's ideal tan. So that tan matches the shoes and it matches the belt and it all tones in for a very tonal outfit with jeans. So, what do you think of that one? Comfy, comfy, but quite smart so let's move on to outfit number six is it let's see so i thought well you can't really do denim jeans seven ways without doing a denim jacket can you so this is the probably the most casual out of them all so it's just a denim jacket that i've had for years and years and years a plain white round neck t-shirt with long sleeves but I've turned back the cuffs on the denim jacket and let the long sleeves let that show because I think I think it goes well with the white pumps that way I've put a red belt on for a change just for a little kick of colour I've got a red handbag just on the shoulder one and I've got my white trainers on and I've folded the jeans back again to show some ankle to try and elongate me because I've got pumps on. So that's 
So yeah, two different colours of denim, doesn't matter. The jacket's a lot lighter than, than the bottoms, as you can see, but I don't think that matters at all. Yeah, and I think the red belt is just enough with the bag. Don't think you need to go over the top with red. Red's very trendy this year, but for a lot of people I have realised um, it's not a colour that they often go for, and I never did. Um, but I did buy myself that red top that you saw last week um, from Stratovarius, and apparently there is a Stratovarius in the traffic centre. I never knew that. So yeah, just that pop of red. I suppose if I wanted to, I could put some red earrings in, red lipstick, and then that would be it. Red nail varnish, maybe. <laughs> so, yeah, that's really casual, but still smart enough, I think. So, I'll just take the denim jacket off, and then you can see. You could sling it over your shoulders. <laughs> you could tie it round your waist. Most people do that, don't they? To get too warm. Tie it round your waist. Very handy, a denim jacket. So yeah, plain white, red belt. Good to go, as <laughs> some people would say. Right, this is the last outfit now. I need to count them. I might have done eight, I don't know. I'll have to count them. <laughs> I get carried away. So we've come to the final outfit and I could have gone on, honestly. It's so easy. They go with anything, absolutely anything. Anyway, what I've decided to do for the last one is kind of like an in-between the outfit. Uh, so obviously I've got the jeans on, I've got a um, camel coloured jumper on, I've got a tan belt to bring out the camel colour and a um, tan bag, my leather jacket, pleather jacket, <laughs> faux leather and um, the little ankle boots. Yeah. So that is the last outfit. So there's a lot of things you can do, isn't there, with a pair of jeans, honestly. Lots of things. I really, really... I've really, really enjoyed doing this video. It hasn't been easy to keep changing clothes. <laughs> But I have enjoyed it. So I hope you have too. And I hope you've got some inspiration. And I've given you just a few ideas of what you can do with your jeans. Dress them up, dress them down. Be casual. Go for a meal. Go for a wander around on a, on a city break. You know, sightseeing, shopping. There was something there for everything, I think. Yeah. So I'd like to say... So, if you've enjoyed this uh, content, please would you give me a thumbs up, um, leave a heart in the comment section and uh, like and share with your friends if you think some of your friends might like it and uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed and also if you could hit the notification bell and set it to all, it will mean that you get notified and you won't ever miss one of my uploads. So, I, I would appreciate that very much. And um, I hope you have a lovely week, weekend, because this is going up next Friday. So I hope you have a lovely weekend and uh, you have a nice rest and a nice chill. And I hope the weather's better. So <laughs> fingers crossed. I will see you on the next one. Bye for now.